everyone. We are 3D Monotech. We are pioneered in additive manufacturing industry and 3D scanning industry. Today, we will be discussing about our partnered machine, uh, Bigrep One. So, we will review this machine uh, one by one about the products, features, materials available, what are the prototypes uh, or a functionality it can produce, and what are the applications it can be used. And uh, we will review everything, each and uh, everything from, about the machine, Bigrep One. Uh, they are actually a large scale uh, additive manufacturing provider. It is basically from Germany and they have like different machines uh, like Bigrep 1 Studio, Bigrep Edge and uh, Bigrep Pro. Now we will be reviewing about uh, Bigrep 1 which is a large scale 1 meter cube volume printer and uh, we can print like uh, continuous production uh, for, uh, for 24 bar 7. It's uh, one of the monstrous machines. Uh, in FDM technology. So this basically works on FDM technology. So this figure of one uh, is actually having a big volume of 1 meter cube uh, build volume. So that you can print your print your bigger uh, parts up to like 1 meter, 1 meter and 1 meter. So you can print really a large scale parts like a sofa or an interiors or a wall dividers like that you can print with the figure of one. What are all the other features uh, with Bigger of One? Generally, like uh, you have like two power extruders. Uh, in the new machine, it is coming with a PXC extruder. So you can go on three modes actually. One is like a single mode, which is uh, useful for beginners and that can print uh, efficiently and also on low cost production. Second one will be the dual mode printer, which will be having two extruders, two power extruders that you can you can uh, use it for. Uh, either water soluble material or to print dual materials or to increase your production and the third mode is tandem mode, pin mode actually so you can use your two extruders uh, and you can split it into two half and then that can be used uh, for production at the same time for example if you want to print two parts at the same time that can be possible with bigger part so one extruder will print the same part and the other extruder will print the same part here so that's the main feature of uh, Bigger of One. I will explain that there, there are different modes in Bigger of One. So the first mode which we will be discussing is a single extruder mode. Where with a single extruder, it is it is basically for the beginners who buy the machine for a, a low cost production and for a ma maximum output. So they generally use one, one power extruder uh, which is uh, known as PEX extruder. Uh, which comes with 0.61 mm and 2mm nozzle they can print uh, with one extruder continuously over a uh, 1 meter cube uh, volume printer so that is the first mode and the second mode is uh, dual mode dual mode is nothing but you will be having a two uh, power extruders as you can see here there are two uh, power extruders uh, these two power extruders can be used to print dual materials or else like you can use a water soluble support uh, I, I hope you all guys know about the water soluble support it is something like uh, if you use a normal um, PLA material, that will be used as a support. But instead, if you are using a water soluble support, the support removal time is uh, is way easier and also like way lesser compared to the other uh, other technologies. So that is why you will be having two power extruders. So and also you will be having material versatility as well. Like there are different materials which we will be uh, discussing in the end. So these are the sec uh, second mode and there will be third mode that is known as tandem printing and it is called twin mode. Twin mode is nothing but if you want to print the same part multiple number of times. You are a production uh, based company where you will be producing only one part. All your parts are similar parts. You want to produ uh, produce it at a faster rate or else like faster time period. So what you will do generally, you will split this extruder into half. So you will be uh, place one extruder on this end and one extruder on that end. So you will be printing the same part again and again uh, at the same rate. For example, if one part is taking 10 hours and another part will also be ready at the same 10 hours. So it will be printing at the same time. So that is called twin mode. These are the modes available with Bigger Up 1. The next thing which we will be discussing is about uh, the Bigger Up print bed. So I will explain the print bed and uh, the, the type of leveling uh, it is having. So generally the print bed is X is also 1 meter like and uh, Y is also 1 meter So you will be having the leveling gate at the bottom So on all sides generally you will be doing the leveling with the uh, wrenches or else like spanners uh, There is a control uh, inside the bigger one uh, on the side where you can access the leveling and uh, you can move the extruders to all points and then like, you can level with the leveling gauge 
So the leveling is very simple here, and uh, you can you can able to level it uh, like only once. If you leveled it once, like no need to level it like until you move, move your bigger up to the next place. So that's how simple is the leveling. The next thing I will be explaining is about the speed uh, and. Uh, what rate it can print the maximum speed bigger up one can attain is like 500 mm per second uh, i repeat 500 mm per second which is actually uh, a faster compared to like any fdm printers so generally uh, so if you want to print a, uh, a bigger chair or something you can able to get it within 10 hours or 12 hours so the, the chair which i am sitting is also like printed in bigger and it was printed in like 12 hours 12 hours time so that's how like uh, it is lightweight, stronger, and also like uh, time effective. So that's how like bigger works. Uh, and and it was also having the movement speed. The movement speed can be like up to like 200 mm per second to 300 mm per second. So you can adjust the movement speed, and everything is customizable. The speed, including the printing speed. Printing speed, as I said, the maximum is uh, 500 mm per second. But if you want to print on lower uh, resolutions like 0 0.3, 0 0.4, or 0 0.5. So you will be printing at a, a, a lower speed. When you want to print at, at higher uh, resolutions like 1200 or 1000 microns, then you will be printing at the faster speed. So that's how the bigger work. Now I will explain like there are few things on the back side. Generally you will be having the spool holders for bigger up on the back side. Two spools can be placed on the back side. The spools can be like 2.5 kg, 4.5 kg, 8 kg spools. And there are rollers on the spool holders, uh, so it will roll and the filament will be printed like easily. So that's how the filament is uh, being pulled inside the extruder. And apart from this, uh, there is also like emergency stop all over the uh, bigger. So this black uh, tube is something like an emergency stop. If I press this or if I keep my leg uh, on the emergency stop, printer will basically stop. So it is to avoid uh, like physical damage when someone is using the printer or if some uh, emergency situation uh, in order to stop this machine. So they have given an emergency stop all across the printer. So you don't need to go and press the emergency uh, emergency button. So you just need to keep your hand or uh, your, uh, your leg on the tube so that automatically the emergency works. So that's how like uh, Vikram had made this large scale uh, printer uh, a safest one to operate. And uh, the next thing is. Um, you also have like stepper motors and uh, for X and Y and uh, for that also. The new Vigrip is coming with a lot of add-ons like enclosure add-on. If you think like the Vigrip bond is open and uh, you may think like the, the dust may affect your printer then you can add on like the enclosure. And the next thing is customizable color. If you want your Vigrip on customizable color, you can able to get that. And uh, additional camera, like if you want to monitor your print like 24 by 7, that can be possible. Like you can uh, do an add on for uh, camera as well. So, those are the add ons like Vigrip is giving. And apart from that, the extruders, as I said, like it's a power extruder, uh, you, you can get with different nozzles. Like that is also like 0.6, 1 mm, 2 mm nozzle that if you need, you can buy that too with along with the Vigrip. These are the add ons they are giving. And uh, apart from that, we will discuss the materials. What are the materials Bigrub is giving? The first material is like PLA. PLA is the standard FDM material which will be used overall worldwide. And then they have their own Pro HD. Pro HD is an equivalent material to ABS, but which is bio-friendly. And apart from that, they have a, a ProFlex material uh, which is called a TPU. So flexible components can be printed. And uh, item CF, item CF is a new material which is like high temperature carbon fiber material. So that can be used for high end applications uh, where you want to have a thermal, uh, uh, thermal things affecting your parts. Then the high temp CF is a perfect material for you. It can withstand up to 115 degrees Celsius. Then they have a, a water soluble material called BU OH which can be uh, used with any uh, FDM filament which they are uh, producing. So the water soluble material usually you have to dissolve it in water and within like 16 to 18 hours uh, the water soluble material will be dissolved completely inside the water or if you have an agitator then it will uh, it will dissolve faster. So those are all the materials which Vikram uh, is producing. They have like uh, uh, flex materials also. Uh, the material versatility, versatility is vast from Vikram but it depends on what application you are using. So let me discuss like what all the applications this Bigrub can be used to. First thing is research and education. 
whatever uh, like comes first is all uh, is research and education when you want to do any research for bigger products or if you want to do a prototype for any pro product this is the uh, first grade machine which you will prefer because you can get it faster and you can get it like uh, at a cheaper cost the second thing is like it can be used for uh, sand casting applications then it can be used for a uh, uh, decent picture or a uh, large scale uh, prototyping applications and apart from that uh, for a uh, molding applications and also like for uh, uh, display purpose and interior applications for architectural applications so uh, so architectural uh, when i talk about architectural like interiors like you, you can print chairs you can print sofas or uh, you can print like uh, uh, wall dividers or you can print your own plant case or uh, uh, plant vase so different things that you can print with bigrep at a, a faster and cheaper rate compared to the other printers these are the applications which Vigrep uh, is uh, produced for and uh, one more thing is like application is not limited uh, to the technology it depends upon the creativity of the user the, like uh, it may change depending upon the user like for example I may use for this uh, Vigrep on an aeronautical base for aerospace application but if your creativity is like uh, uh, different like you can use, it, use this for any applications in the industry Talking about the applications, uh, these are like few samples uh, which can be printed with Vigrep on a large scale. Like it can be used on medical industry and archaeological industry. For example, uh, like considering this example, like it's a dinosaur, like uh, we don't need to search for dinosaur uh, bones or something. Like we can able to when, when we can print them. And similarly, like if you want to showcase uh, uh, medical uh, skeletons or else like uh, bones, you can able to 3D print with Vigrep. And then you can display and you, you can give it to your students or you can explain uh, in the medical industry. So those are one of the applications. And apart from this, uh, there are a few, few more applications and few more samples. So it can be used uh, on a musical industry as well. Uh, you can print uh, musical equipments uh, and you can print like a classic interior or Warner items like this. So that can be post process and it can be used in your households. These are few examples uh, that we have printed with Vigrep. Uh, let us know like what you want to see on Vigrep.